What's cracking YouTube? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening and today we're going to be busting into this breakthrough elite trainer box. So this is the Mega Mewtwo X elite trainer box and this isn't just a standard opening today, it is a Elite Trainer Box Battle against Poke Nation. So I'll leave, I'll leave a link on screen to her channel now. And in the description of the video, I'll leave a link to her side of the battle. So be sure to go check that out and compare, compare the videos. But yeah, um, this is just going to be like a standard opening. And we're going to just display everything like normal. Admire all the contents of the Elite Trainer Box. And yeah, so I'm just going to have a quick fast forward section to get everything out of this Elite Trainer Box. And then I'll we'll get straight into the video. I'll see you guys in a sec. Alrighty guys, and we're back. Sorry that took a little bit longer than expected, but we do have some goodies to show off today. So we have the energies, as per usual, you get five of each energy, so I'll just knock that down a smidge. Cool, so they're all like nearly tucked inside this little plastic band here, so just throw them off to the side. Um, also we have the blue dice, so it's a nice uh, blue Mewtwo themed dice with the Primal Clash logo just there. Sweet. We have the uh, burn and poison damage counters kind of thing, just there. Um, also we have the Mewtwo themed sleeves, which is always nice. They're like nice and silvery, shiny on that side. But yeah, they look awesome. Every single time you like open the, one of these Elite Trainer boxes, the sleeves are always just awesome. Looks so good. But yeah, then we have the... Uh, card like deck dividers so these um you obviously the box in the back here is a card box and you can use these to split up the cards inside that box which is very handy we also have the uh code card at the back there for the um i'm guessing it's the sleeves online i haven't actually used one yet they're all kind of just put aside at the moment to be used online but let's throw all these up the back here just to have a nice mewtwo theme going on because it looks pretty sweet yeah it looks pretty pretty sweet just knock it all over just that smidge there we go and then also you get this awesome little players guide so I'll just knock that up a little bit and I'll have a nice look through here so obviously you can use this as a checklist or um just to kind of look at what's inside of the set but yeah let's go to the back where the full art and secret rares are because that is these are the pulls that I am looking for I've completed the set but if I were to get anything, it would be those guys. But yeah, so that those books are always pretty cool as well. And of course, inside these Elite Trainer Boxes, we have the eight booster packs. So these were actually stacked very nice and neatly inside of this, boost, uh, this Elite Trainer Box. But yeah, so before I get into the actual opening of this Elite Trainer Box, uh, I'd just like to quickly explain the point system. So it's one point for a reverse rare, two points for a holo rare, three points for an EX or a break, uh, four points for a full art, and five points for a secret rare. So I'll, I'll leave that in the description of the video as well if you guys would like to keep tabs. And I spoke a little bit too quickly for you then. But yeah, so here we go. So this is pack number one out of eight. So this could be a fairly high scoring high scoring video. And all the codes today will be given out to you guys as well. So don't fret, there we go. Hope you guys get something nice from that. And let's see, see if we can get some good points on the board. At the moment, I'm on a uh, fairly bad luck streak when it comes to these pack battles. My first one against Yellow Solo was good, but then um, my MLPB pack battle against Jay didn't go all too well. All too well at all. But we got Pilot Swine, we got Grand Ball. Okay, nice. So we're kicking it off strong. We have three points on the board with a Chesnaught break. And can we get the double? Can we, can we, can we? No, we can't. So we got a Raichu regular rare. But that's all good in the hood because we have this nice looking Chesnaught break. It looks a little bit faded, to be honest. The color, I don't know. Strange, but cool. But awesome. So let's throw that one up the back, nice and central there. 
all that Mewtwo, that Mewtwo goodness up back there. We're talking about Mewtwo, we got Mega Mewtwo X here, so let's see if we can keep piling up the scoreboard. Keep on on, and it's very interesting, the codes are actually the right way for this newer product. There we go, there's the code for you guys. One, two. And I believe I've just felt that textured goodness, so let's see. Let's see what we can get today. Let's see what we can get. So we have another four points on board, if you guys didn't know, so be prepared to add that on. But we've got a Ghastly. We've got Pyloswine. A Gramble. Super Rod. A Reverse Rainbow Energy, so that one's just an un uncommon. And our Full Art is... A Giovanni Scheme Full Art. Okay, so this, um, me and Giovanni go way back to my pre-release. This was actually the, f the first Full Art I ever pulled from Breakthrough. But yeah, nice. So we have seven points on the board now. Crazy. Oh, let's just have a quick, quick close-up of Giovanni. So it's like, uh, draw cards until you have five cards in your hand, or during this turn your opponent's Pokemon's attacks do... Tw oh, no. During this turn, your Pokemon's attacks do 20 more damage to your opponent's active Pokemon be before applying weakness and resistances. Okay. Cool, but yeah, Giovanni looks so devious there. He's like... Ah, la, la, la. la 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 la. <laughs> anyway, let's keep going. So, pack number three. <laughs> we're, um, we're two from two at the moment, so we've opened up two packs and we've got two pulls. So, let's see if we can keep the streak rolling. We've got to have a dud pack somewhere though. It's all expected. It's all expected. But there's the code. First in best dressed. Hope you guys get something nice as per usual. And I hope I can get something nice as well. But yeah, we got Pan Sage. Hippopotas. Piplop. Doduo. Remoraid. Spupa. Snorlax. A Vanillish. A Behem. That one's just an uncommon. And... A Braviary regular rare. Okay, so we had to break the streak sometime. Had to happen, but there we go. So just a Braviary regular rare. Next pack. Mega Mewtwo Y. Nice, 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 nice. Hopefully, I can break my losing streak against Poke Nation today. But we don't, we don't want to destroy her too much. We don't want to um win by too much because that could be almost an insult so let's uh, let's try keep it to a reasonable uh, scoreboard here today but we've got Goldeen, we got Teddy Ursa, Scatterbug, Rolts, Dedenne, whoops, Starmie, Skylar, a Heavy Ball Reverse which is just an uncommon and a Smeagol regular air Okay, so we started off pretty strong, but now we're gonna, I think we're gonna head into that dead patch of the openings where it kind of just goes um, a little bit mellow, and then we, hopefully we can... A floor, just regular air. Okay. So that's two pulls from two packs, and then we got three dud packs so far. So now we're on the sixth pack. Zorok Break Art. So this pack does feel relatively thick. I got high high expectations to this. It's like they've jammed all the all the goodies into this pack. Hopefully, hopefully my um, hunch is not wrong. But there's the code for you guys. But I don't know you guys, I don't know. I think my hunch is wrong. But let's see, we got a Goldeen. Cyndaquil, Hippopotas, Cubone, Eljum, Heavy Boots, a Fracture, a Burning Energy, a Buddy Buddy Rescue Reverse, that one's just an uncommon, and a Bronzong Real Rare. Okay, so we've just opened up four packs in a row now, and we've got, uh, got nothing, so interesting. Interesting, inter interesting. So that has Pain Amplifier and Knock Away. Cool. 
Second last pack. So we got Mega Mewtwo X on the pack R. And I hope you guys are getting some good stuff from these codes. Now be sure to drop a comment in the comment section below if you are. Uh, if you did manage to skip a code up and you are getting something nice from them. But yeah, we got Goldeen, Teddy Ursa, a Scatterbot, Ralts, Pansage, Heavy Ball, a Rainbow Energy, Cacturn, a Reverse Ralts, that one's just a common, and a Vanillax regular rare. <laughs> oh no. We are on the driest of streaks right now. This is like six packs with all regular rares. So that it just has frigid breath and deep freeze with 130 HP. Okay, and the final pack of this Elite Trainer Box battle against Poke Nation. We have the Houndoom pack art. So Houndoom, can you come through with the goods? Only the finest of pulls for us today. Please and thank you. Please and thank you. So there's the final code. Three, one, two, and I don't know. I don't know what I just felt. I don't know if I felt a full art or nothing. But who knows? Let's let's see what we can get. That's I know. That's weird. We got a Woobat, a Fracture, Burning Energy, Swoobat, a, re a Reverse Paris, which is just a common, and. No way! We felt a full art indeed. We got a Mega Glalie EX full art. What an elite trainer box. That was just crazy. That was really like the calm before the storm. Dead set is like six packs that just all regular rares and all of a sudden it's just like boom. I, I don't know how to what to say. We like started it off with this or this one being the second pull. We started it off with the Chesnaw in the first pack, Giovanni in the second pack, and then Mega Glalie in the eighth and the final pack. So let's just have a quick suss at Mega Glalie. Let's admire this for a second. So we've got um, Mega Glalie, 220 HP. It has Cryo Mouth as its attack. And yeah, that's 156 out of 162. What a strong looking card. I don't know. It just really kind of kind of pops in comparison to the regular Glalie art. But yeah, so let's have a, a quick point recap. So we got no reverse rares, no hollow rares, but we did manage to scoop up the Chesnaut Break, which is three points. Giovanni Scheme Full Art, which is four points, so that makes seven. And then we got the Mega Glalie EX Full Art, which is another four points, which gives me a grand total of 11 points. So I'm going to wish the best of luck to Poke Nation, and I hope she gets some awesome pulls. But at the same time, I hope she doesn't because then I don't win. But anyway, be sure to drop a like on the video if you guys enjoyed. Be sure to check out Poke Nation's side of the battle. I'll leave a link on screen now. And I'll also leave a link in the, in the top of the description of the video. But yeah, so be sure to check that out. And let me know in the comments um, if I've won or if Poke Nation has managed to steal the victory from me and kept me on this losing streak. But yeah, um, subscribe if you're new to my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next opening. Thanks for watching. Peace.